Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to live with Hassan Akhtar. Viewers are today's lesson related to class 9th, unit number 2, name of the unit, real and complex numbers. Dear students, as you already know, we are solving exercise 2.6. So our today's first question is question number 7. Statement says, solve the following equations for real x and y. Part number 1 is 2 minus 3 iota into x plus y iota is equal to 4 plus iota. Starting our solution, first step same as that of question. The next step very easy, very interesting that we multiply both the terms of the first bracket one by one with the total second bracket. That is, you can see number 2 will be multiplied with both the items of the second bracket x plus y iota. Then minus 3 iota will be multiplied with both the elements of the second bracket. This is the most easiest way of multiplication. Now in the next step, just opening the brackets, we have 2x plus 2y iota minus 3 iota into x plus y iota. So we have 2x plus 2y iota minus 3x iota minus 3y iota square is equal to same right hand side 4 plus iota. Dear students, we are working on the left hand side and converting them into some simplified frame. Here in the next step, utilizing iota square is equal to minus 1 as you can see. We have 2x plus 2y iota minus 3x iota minus 3y into minus 1 which is equal to 4 plus iota. Gathering the terms, 2x plus 2y iota minus 3x iota plus 3y is equal to 4 iota. Now arranging them in a manner that iota terms to be calculated together and those without iota to be written together we have 2x plus 3y plus minus 3x plus 2y into iota is equal to 4 plus iota. Here comparing both the left hand side and right hand side the first part that is 2x plus 3y uh, is not containing any iota here the first part is only 4 is not containing any iota so they are equal which implies that 2x plus 3y is equal to 4 that is our equation number 1 whereas the second part involving iota that is minus 3x plus 2y on the right hand side it is written iota that means 1 iota so comparing iota terms we have minus 3x plus 2y is equal to 1. Our next target is to solve equation number 1 and 2 to reach at some final answer. For that multiplying equation number 1 by 3 and equation number 2 by 2 we have 6x plus 9y is equal to 12 that equation number 1 is converted into this frame and equation number 2 by multiplying by number 2 it becomes minus 6x plus 4y is equal to 2 very simple that now 6x with plus sign and 6x with minus sign will go cancel you will be left with plus 9y plus 4y is equal to 13y which is equal to on the right hand side 12 plus 2 is equal to 14 dividing both the terms by number 13 we have y is equal to 14 over 13 now using this value of y in equation number 1 we have 2x plus 3 into 14 over 13 is equal to 4 multiplying by number 13 that is our LCM we have 26x plus 42 is equal to 52. Shifting 42 on the right hand side we have 26x is equal to 52 minus 42 that is we are left with 26x is equal to 10 here to find the value of x dividing both sides by 26 we have x is equal to 10 over 26 making cancellation by number 2 we have finally x is equal to 5 over 13 so our final answer is x is equal to 5 over 13 that can also be considered as the real part whereas the imaginary part that we already calculated is y is equal to 14 over 13 that makes our first part answer complete hope you all understand we move next towards part number 3. The value is 3 plus 4 iota whole square minus 2 into x minus y iota is equal to 
x plus y iota starting our solution considering the same step of question as the first step of our solution and next we are having the first bracket of the frame a plus b whole square can be written as a square plus b square plus 2ab so we have 3 square plus 4 iota square plus 2 into 3 into 4 iota minus 2x plus 2y iota by opening the second bracket by multiplying with minus 2 right hand side is same x plus y iota next step simplifying we have square of 3 is 9 whereas square of 4 iota is 16 iota square multiplying 2 into 3 into 4 we get 24 iota minus 2x plus 2y iota remain same the right hand side x plus y iota remains same utilizing iota square is equal to minus 1 we have 9 plus 16 into minus 1 other terms remain same that is plus 24 iota minus 2x plus 2y iota and no change in the right hand side on the left hand side arranging the terms without iota and with iota together we have 9 minus 16 plus 24 iota minus 2x plus 2y iota is equal to x plus y iota simplifying further we are left minus 7 minus 2x plus 24 iota plus 2y iota is equal to x plus y iota in the next step writing the terms within bracket without iota and those involving iota by taking iota as common we have minus 7 minus 2x plus 24 plus 2y into iota is equal to x plus y iota here comparing both the sides left hand side and right hand side you can see that the first term bracket on the left hand side that is minus 7 minus 2x it is equal to x because both are real not containing any iota whereas that of second bracket 24 plus 2y into iota and y iota by making comparison we have 24 plus 2y is equal to y hope you all understand up till here next we have by shifting x and 2x on the one side we have minus 7 is equal to x plus 2x whereas 2y minus y is equal to minus 24 so our result minus 7 is equal to 3x and y is equal to minus 24 to find the value of x dividing both sides by number 3 we have x is equal to minus 7 over 3 that make all our real part whereas y is equal to minus 24 that can be considered as the imaginary part that makes the solution complete dear students this question is important came in the past in the board exams hope you understand thank you very much